My feet are getting sore. I must have stepped on every rock between Rolonia and here. You didn't tell me that adventure seeking would be this hard on my feet. <laughs> yeah, Grubby. Octopedes do have a lot of feet to worry about. Yep. Hmm. Why don't we camp here for the night? That sounds good to me. Mm. Grubby, are you mm. sure those roots are edible? Well, I don't know if they're edible or not, but they sure are good to eat. <laughs> they're good raw, or fried, or baked, but you're about to have my specialty. Mmm, roasted root. Roasted root? Yeah, here, have one. Well, how do you like it? Um, <coughs> well, uh... Yeah, it's... aren't they good? Mmm. Oh, Teddy... Do you miss home any? Yes, I guess I do a little. Hmm. But we've only been gone a few days. Well, I know. But you're the first Iliop to leave Rolonia in a long time. And I thought you might be getting homesick. It's true. Iliops aren't very adventurous. At least they haven't been for many generations. But somehow, I've always had this desire to go on a journey to Grundo. And I want to find out if this old map really leads to a treasure. Yeah, you've been talking about that since we were little. Hey, you want some more roots? Uh, no thank you. Beware of bounders. Hmm, what do you suppose that means? I don't know, but there doesn't seem to be any other way to go. You're right. Well, let's go. Bounders, bounders. Huh. I wonder if whoever wrote that sign meant boulders. Hmm, that could be. There's lots of rocks up there. Look at that. Hopping mouths. <laughs> yeah, and them mouths are full of teeth. Whoa! <laughs> They're going to catch us. Run faster, Grubby. I'm trying. I'm trying. little bounders. I lose more firewood that way. How do you do? Uh, uh, my name is uh, 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 a Newton Gimmick, <laughs> uh, but you can call me uh, uh, a Gimmick. Uh, say, uh, aren't you an uh, Iliop? Yes, I am. You see, Grubby and I came here from our homeland in Melonia. We're on a marvelous journey. Why, uh, that's wonderful. <laughs> ah, I have an idea. Uh, why don't we all go to my house and uh, uh, have a bite to eat? Okay. <laughs> that would be very nice, Gimmick. Uh, what sort of journey are you on? You think we ought to talk about that? Oh, I'm sure we can trust Gimmick, and he might recognize something on the map. Hmm. This map has been in my family for generations. We think it belonged to my great-great-grandfather. <laughs> How 
Don't bother me, LB. I've almost got it. Ugh. Stop that. What is it you want? Oh, oh, you've got that piece of wood stuck in your mouth again. All right, me. Oh. Guess what? Be quiet. I'm sure I've got the right combination this time. <laughs> Just think, to actually make gold out of buttermilk. <laughs> <laughs> gold out of buttermilk. Gold out of buttermilk. Tweed, the closest you've ever come to making gold is a buttermilk donut. LB, how many times do I have to tell you? The name is Tweeg! Tweeg! Hey, Tweez, your gold is getting stale. LB, I thought I told you to be quiet! Gimmick has visitors. Listen, I've told you for the last time... Gimmick has visitors? Uh, yup. <laughs> Two of them. Why didn't you tell me sooner? I tried. Oh, oh, I knew that Gimmick was up to no good. I've always known he wanted to steal my formula. <laughs> yeah, he's probably dying to make buttermilk donuts. <laughs> You're right, LB. There they are. They must be making plans to attack. LB, run down there and find out what they're saying. You run down and find out what they're saying. Run down and find out what they're saying. Okay. Uh, this'll teach Gimmick a thing or two. <laughs> what was that? Uh, 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 oh, nothing. <laughs> it's just Twig firing his cannon at us. At at us? us? Whoa! Whoa! Oh, <laughs> don't worry. It's been going on ever since I moved here. It used to bother me, too, until I uh, realized that he is, without a doubt, <laughs> the world's worst shot. <laughs> well, who is this Tweeg, anyway? Well, um, uh, I'm not sure. I've never actually seen him. As long as he's shooting at my house, it's probably the safest place in the valley to be. <laughs> uh... <laughs> now, why don't we take a look at your treasure map? This was with the map, but no one has ever been able to explain what it is. Well, it looks like part of a medallion. It appears to be made of uh, 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 gold and a uh, kind of crystal. Yes, and there's writing on it. Spirit Treasure Ledge. Sounds spooky to me. Now, let's see. This is indeed an old map. It says here that the treasure is in the ancient, hard-to-find city, which lies high in the treacherous mountains. I've heard that they are impossible to climb, <laughs> which brings me to why you were fortunate to have met me. <laughs> Come with me. The fact is, I'm something of an inventor. Gentlemen, uh, this is my latest invention. I call it an airship. And I'm about to try it out uh, for the first time. Hmm. Kind of looks like a boat. Well, uh, uh, as a matter of fact, it did start out to be a boat, uh, but then I realized uh, I'm not very close to water. <laughs> no, you're not very close to water. Yeah, it would be kind of good for a boat to be close to water. Precisely. Uh, that was my exact conclusion. But then the idea hit me. Uh, if a boat could float on water, it could also float on air. If the air is hot, that is. Uh, with this airship, we can fly as high and as free as a bird. We can fly right over the treacherous mountains to the hard-to-find city. That's wonderful. You are more than welcome to share the treasure, if we're lucky enough to find it, that is. Yeah, there should be plenty of treasure. All right, uh, let's get underway. If you fellas can begin loading this firewood, I'll go inside and uh, yeah, yeah, pack some provisions. All right. Horrid little bounders. <laughs> 
look at you. That's twice in one day you've had that log in your mouth. Can't you do anything right? <laughs> oh, can't I do anything right? I ought to take that treasure map somewhere else. Yeah, yeah. Oh, treasure map? What treasure map, huh? The one you're holding in your hand, Twing. Did you put my gold samples and formulae in a safe place? It's all taken care of. Is the wagon loaded? Uh, that's all taken care of, too. <laughs> now sneak back to gimmicks with this phony map. <laughs> oh, all right, Tweez. And uh, uh, keep the fire hot, Grubby. Okay, gimmick. A gimmick? Do we have all the supplies? Uh, 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 yes. Where's the map? Oh, um, uh, uh, let me see. Uh, now, where did I put that map? I don't see it here anywhere. Well, uh, I'll go and uh, check in the house. Uh, what's hey, going what's on? What's happened? Well, I don't hey, know. Fred, what's what happened? Do you Fred? know? Teddy, something about the design of this airship doesn't seem quite right. Yes, Grubby. I've had that feeling, too. But I can't put my finger on what it is. Have you mentioned it to Gimmick? No, I haven't. Do you think I should? Oh, <laughs> here's the map. <laughs> yes. I found the map. Oh, good. Here, I'll put it with the rest of the supplies. Say, Gimmick, something about the design of this airship doesn't seem quite right. Oh, don't worry, my boy. <laughs> it's uh, uh, working just like I expected. We're off the ground. We're really flying. Yeah, it's amazing, Gimmick. Hey, we're flying. But something's... Uh, cast off the line. Okay. Teddy, something just doesn't seem quite right. And I think I know what it is. <laughs> Apparently, something wasn't quite right. Till I, I know it! I've got to hand it to you, Grubby. This design does seem to work a bit better. Just a minor modification. All right. And now that everything is working properly, let's check the map once more so that we can head in the right direction. Well, gimmick, how do we make the airship head in the right direction? Oh, uh, yeah, we just, um, uh, uh, hmm, that's a very interesting question, Teddy. Well, you better remember the answer pretty quick, gimmick, before we drift into that big tree over there. Hmm, I don't remember making a provision for moving in the, in the right. We're running into the tree! <laughs> What are you doing in my tree? Huh? Uh, uh, oh, who said that? I said that, and I'll say it again. Just what are you doing in my tree? <laughs> it's a tiny flying lady. Hey, would you look at that? What is it? I'm a wood sprite. No, there is no such thing as a, uh, 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 a wood sprite. Oh, no? And I suppose there's no such thing as a big bag of air stuck in my tree, but there it is, big as life. Golly, she is a real wood sprite, no bigger than a bird, and very pretty. Well, how about moving this big... Oh, do you really think I'm pretty? Oh, yes, I certainly do. Oh, <laughs> aren't you sweet? And who are you? Well, I'm Teddy Ruxpin, and this is Grubby, and this is Newton Gimmick. How do you do? My name is Leota. I'm pleased to meet you, and I'm sorry if we've damaged your tree. Oh, that's all right. Is there anything I can do to help? Hmm. Well, I'm not sure. But you do understand the simple basics of aerodynamics, don't you? Uh, huh? Well, first of all, let the hot air out of that bag so you can get down out of my tree. Oh, all right. Now, <clears throat> in order for your airship to move in any given direction, you must apply a force in an opposite direction, such as in this large manually driven propeller. Then you will have to know something about the effect of wind and various aspects of navigation. 
It's really very simple. Everything's ready, Gimmick. All right, release the tether lines. Aye, aye, Gimmick. Okay, Gimmick. <laughs> it's working. All right. It's working perfectly. Thank you, Leota. Oh, you're welcome. Goodbye. Goodbye, Leota. Goodbye. Goodbye. Toodaloo. Don't get stuck in any more trees. <laughs> Gimmick, shouldn't we be getting close to the moss forest? Uh, yes, I think so. Uh, we made good time yesterday. How far north is the moss forest? Um, uh, oh, it's a few hours on foot. Aren't we going south? But look, according to the map, we should be going south. Then there must be something wrong with the map. <gasps> you know, the map does look a lot newer than it used to. And look, it says the treasure is buried in the Great Desert. Hmm. Then it has to be a phony map. The treasure is supposed to be in the treacherous mountains. But who could have switched maps on us? <gasps> Tweed! Uh-oh. Hey, fellas, we're about out of fuel. We're gonna have to land. All right, uh, let's set her down. Uh, maybe we can determine which uh, uh, direction to head in. Uh, I don't think we're gonna find much wood around here. Hmm, I fear you're right, Teddy. This must be the Great Desert. Great, my feet are getting hot. Whoa! Ugh. Are you all right? Uh, yes, I, I'm fine. <laughs> I just tripped over this rock. Hmm. What is it? I thought so. This isn't just a rock. It's coal. You mean the kind of coal that burns? Yes, and if we can find more of it... Uh, hey, we... there's lots more coal in that cave. How about one more load, just to be on the safe side? All right, but we'll have to hurry. It'll be getting dark soon. Gee, it's getting dark in here. Uh, say, fellas, you don't suppose anything lives in here, do you? Uh, it, uh, no. I think that for a region as arid and inhospitable as this desert, to support any form of life as we know it would be uh, virtually impossible. Oh, oh, hey, 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 what's going on? Wait a minute. Say, are you sure this is impossible? No, no. Well, yeah, yeah. Where are you taking us? Where are we going? What's going on? one to work, and take the other two to the dungeon, and lock them up. Pardon me, sir. What is it we've done? If it's the coal you're worried about, we'll be happy to pay you for it. Get them out of here! Ow. Hurry up! Keep moving! Ow. Keep moving! Ow. Gimmick, why are those things so unreasonable? I don't know, Teddy. What kind of creatures are they? I don't know that either. They're mud blobs. Uh, huh? Hello, my name is Teddy Ruxpin, and this is my friend, Newton Gimmick. Well, how do you do? My name is Prince Aaron. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Prince Aaron, uh, the son of King Nogbert? Yes. Well, uh, what are you doing here? Well, my sister, Princess Arusia, was kidnapped and taken from our land. 
I've been searching for her when I was captured by these horrid mud blobs. They captured me with ease. I'm, I'm a failure and a coward. Uh, just because you couldn't fend off those brutes, uh, mud blobs, uh, you called them, mm -hmm. well, uh, that doesn't make you a coward by any means. It's true, Prince Aaron. You shouldn't blame yourself. Well, all I know is I've been here for a long time. There's no telling what's happened to my sister by now. What do you suppose those mud blobs are going to do with us, Gimmick? Oh, I wish I knew, Teddy. What's going on? I don't know. What do you suppose that was all about? Yeah, I haven't a clue, my boy. like glue. Yes, the food here is awful. <laughs> Although this smells worse than usual. <coughs> it seems like I've tasted this stuff somewhere before. Oh, no! What else can happen to oh, us? No. Oh, no! A, a no. cave-in! Look out! No. Prince Aaron! Oh, no. Are you oh, right? Help. Gimmick! Oh. Gimmick! Help. Look out! Look, look! I see light up there. Maybe if you stand on my shoulders, you can see where it's coming from. It leads to the surface. Come on, we can get out. I thought we'd never find the airship. I don't think we should have left Grubby behind. I know, Teddy, but we had no choice. No, we didn't. Yes, you're right, but I just hope Grubby is all right. Gimmick, it's working. <laughs> Naturally, my boy. <laughs> Didn't I tell you it would? Now, all we have to do is uh, uh, locate Grubby. Grubby! Grubby! Hey, fellas, I'm in here. Grubby, are you all right? Teddy, Gimmick. <laughs> hey, it's great to see you. Did they let you out? No, we escaped, and we came back to free you. Come on, let's go. Well, okay, as soon as I finish this batch of mmm, root stew. You mean you were making that stuff we were eating? Yeah. <laughs> These mud guys love my root stew. I even talked them into giving you an extra portion. Oh, thanks. You're welcome. More mud blops are coming. Come on, Grubby, let's get out of here. Oh, all right. Fast off! I was afraid you wouldn't make it. Gimmick was right about the Mudblop's eyes being extra sensitive to light. His plan worked perfectly. Oh, uh, Prince Aaron, uh, this is Grubby. Hello, Prince Aaron. How are you, Grubby? Uh, okay, thank you. Um, gee, uh, are you a real prince? That's right. But just wait till you meet his sister, Princess Arusia. Wow, a princess, too. Well, what do you mean, Teddy? I don't understand. Well, Gimmick and I have discussed it, and I'm sure Grubby will agree. The search for your sister is very important. But, but I only ask that you take me to the edge of the desert. You're looking for the treasure, and I don't expect you to... The get treasure up. can wait. Besides, we've made up our minds, so please stop arguing. Indeed, Prince Aaron. Teddy is right. We want to help you find your sister. Yep, we sure do. Well, thank you. Thank you all very much. Twig, are we almost there yet? LB, will you stop asking that? Besides, we'd probably be at the treacherous mountains by now if you wouldn't keep getting us lost. I don't get us lost, Twig. You're driving. Well, I've got my hands full reading this map and, uh, and thinking about all that wonderful treasure. <laughs> so hurry up, LB. There, 
down there, I see a waterfall. Oh, good. Set her down. Hey, what's that thing? Hmm. Uh, yeah, I don't know, but it looks uh, dangerous. Well, we gotta get it out of there, because I'm thirsty. Uh, excuse me. Hey, excuse me. Do you think we could get some water, please? No! Go away! Hey, you! Get out of there! What did you say? Well, um, uh, uh, we gotta be off on our mission to find Princess Arusia, and, uh, well, you're holding us up. Go on! Say a princess? Yeah, Princess Arusia, the sister of Prince Aaron here. How come she's lost? Well, actually, she's been kidnapped. <gasps> kidnapped? <gasps> Why would anybody kidnap a princess? That's bad. Well, we don't know who took her or why. All I know is, I've got to get her back. Well, then, what you ought to do is talk to the wizard. Uh, the wizard? Yeah! The wizard, he knows everything. Well, here we are. I hope the wizard can help. Well, uh, we'll soon find out. Who presumes to disturb the solitude of the wizard? Oh, um, yes. Um... Go away! I thought I said to go away! Yes, you did, sir. But my sister, Princess Arusia, is missing. And I understand that you might be able to help. Princess? Uh, just stay there a minute. What was that? Oh, I'm the Wally Watson. Well, uh, you stay outside. The rest of you come in. Now, what was that you wanted? Well, sir, my sister, Princess Arusia, has been kidnapped, and we're trying to locate her. All right, come with me. Hey, Louis. Yeah? Have we got any footage on a Princess Arusia? I don't know. What does she look like? Well, probably like her brother sitting out there. Take a look. He's the one in the soldier suit. Hmm. Oh, yeah. I think I remember a kid that looks like that. Let me see him. Yeah, here she is, with the Gatangs. I wondered what she was doing with them. Well, according to her brother, she's been kidnapped. Really? Well, this information ought to be worth something. Okay, put the film on the machine. Now, everyone concentrate so that we may bring forth the mystical powers of communication. Uh, uh huh? I said concentrate. Good, good. Everyone concentrate on where Princess Arusia could be. I see it now. Princess Arusia is being held by the flying Gatangs. What's that? A trapeze act? But she's afraid of heights. Pay attention. Look into the magic eye. 
high in the treacherous mountains, the ancient hard-to-find city provides the stronghold for the Gatangs. Treacherous mountains, hard-to-find city. That's where the treacherous... From their mountain fortress, the evil Gatangs maintain a constant vigil. With their many weapons and bat-like aircraft, they stand prepared to fend off an attack by even the strongest of foes. Oh. The Katang's latest villainous act is to have carried out the successful kidnapping of the beloved Princess Arusia. Look, look, there's my sister. How do we get to the treacherous mountains? To the northeast. But no one has ever been able to scale the treacherous mountains. Thank you, wizard. Thank you. Oh, yes. Thank you again, sir. I hope you find her. Thank you, Wooly. You take good care of that princess. I will. Goodbye. I'll never get up to that ancient, hard-to-find city. You're no help at all. Well, we've only been trying to climb these mountains for two weeks. Haven't you had enough yet? Oh, all that treasure up there, and I can't get at it. It's Gimmick and those other guys. How did they get here, anyway? They had the wrong map. What could have gone wrong? They'll fly right up to that hard-to-find city! Oh, they'll take every bit of that treasure! Uh, they're landing! There won't be anything left for me! Uh, they're landing! Why does it always have to happen to me? <gasps> they're landing. Teddy, I'm glad you wanted me to make this root stew. I was beginning to think that maybe you didn't like it. Oh, uh, not at all. Uh, I think it might come in very handy. Yeah, uh, uh, yeah, we're ready to cast off. Hurry up, Albie. <laughs> Come on now, let's find that treasure. Look, there's a guard over there. Yeah, let's get him. Okay, but be quiet. Oh, oh my! We got him. Boy, oh, he's strong. Pull his helmet off. Keep him from yelling. Here's the rope. Tie him up. Is. That's the building that was in the wizard's pictures. That's where they took my sister. Okay, let's go. Look, there she is. And we've been ordered to take her out of here. Just who ordered you to take her? Oh, um, um, it uh, was, uh... Get him! What's going on in here? Oh, uh, nothing. I just dropped something. Well, keep it down. I was winning that hand. Oh, Aaron! Aaron, you've come to rescue me! <laughs> Arusia, are you all right? Oh, yes. I'm fine now that you're here. I came as soon as I could. I I wouldn't have made it if it weren't for my friends. We'd better leave, Prince Aaron, before we're discovered. Grubby, get another helmet. Grubby, I think I know this place. It, it looks like the shrine on the map. Golly, I think you're right. 
Look, look! It's the other half of the medallion. Look, it fits perfectly. Only the pure of spirit may find the treasure of knowledge. going and what are those things they're carrying uh well i don't know twig but i see where they're running from and it looks like that building on the map you're right lb that's where the treasure's supposed to be <laughs> oh, <yippee! laughs> oh i'm rich i'm rich i'm rich <laughs> 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 Uh-oh, we've been discovered. More fuel. Uh-oh, here come those airplanes. They're shooting at us. Get down, Aruzia. Okay. We have to get out of range of those weapons. Oh, no. We're not going anywhere now. We'll be pulled back to the city. Grubby, bring out the root stew. Huh? Okay, but this seems like a strange time to be having breakfast. Put a spoonful of the stew right in this sling. Okay. Good shooting, Teddy. You got him. Look at that. <laughs> The one on the left port side. Give me some of that stuff, buddy. <laughs> That's some shooting. They're going to launch more planes. Hey, there's Wooly. <gasps> yeah! <laughs> and I thought no one could climb the treacherous mountains. Get him, Wooly. <laughs> An airplane's coming at us from the left. Give me some more roots, too. The ball, good shot right in the propeller. It's going down. More stew, Grubby. More stew, Grubby. Oh, no. We're all out of stew. What do we do? I don't know. Yes, I guess we took care of those gatangs. Well, Teddy, maybe you don't like the taste of my root stew, but you did find something that it was good for. Yeah, you're right, Grubby. It worked very well. I think we should all be proud of ourselves, especially you, Wooly. Indeed. What can we ever do to repay you? Oh, I 
I've already been paid. I got to see a real life princess. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Teddy, there sure was a lot of treasure up there in that shrine. Yes, there was. And what do you suppose these things are? I don't know, Grubby. But somehow, I think they're more important than all that treasure. I think you're right, Teddy. Only the pure of spirit may find the treasure of knowledge. It's as though whoever left this message wanted us to take these crystals. And I think that what we will learn from these crystals will make all that treasure look like just an illusion. <laughs> Come on, LB. Give me a hand. I still can't figure out why those guys left all this treasure here. How could those things they were carrying be more important than this treasure? <laughs> what? Where did it go? Oh, no! Oh, no! Let's meet a lovely princess and stand before a king. Let's dream a great adventure and let us live that magic dream. And if our dreams are good one, and if we see it through... Look! There's my home! There's my home! Then the wondrous dream we dream tonight Someday, just might, come true.